Hello everyone, welcome to the Savvy Professor. In today's video, I will show you how to create a 3D carousel in Figma using Smart Animate. Let's get started. Open the Figma file where you want to create a 3D carousel, ensuring all the elements and images are already inserted. Create a desktop frame by pressing F on your keyboard and insert a frame from the right hand side window. If you have a header, insert it as well. Group the label into a new frame by selecting all of them and pressing Ctrl or G. Resize the frame, ensuring it perfectly fit the labels. Create four rectangles behind the labels, matching their colors for a cohesive look. Ensure each rectangle aligns precisely with the center of the corresponding label. Duplicate the can and use it as a mask for the label. Create a mask by selecting the duplicate of the can and the labels. Change the color of desktop frame to match the label color for a tuneful appearance. Add shadows beneath the can by using the pen tool to draw shapes. Adjust the color and blur to your preferences. Duplicate the desktop frame. Enter into the can by selecting it and hitting enter and drag it to the left until the next label is not visible. Match the desktop color to the label color. Repeat this process for the next desktop frames. Add the names of the fruits at the back of the can using the text tool. Write each fruit name spreadly. Give them a new frame by pressing Ctrl R G. Align them to in center and send them to back of the can. Copy and paste the text in each frame. Change the fruit name accordingly and send them to the back of the text. Repeat this process for the next desktop frames. Now it's time to refine the prototype. Go to prototype menu and link the first desktop frame to the second with drag and smart animation. Now click the second frame to the third and match the setting to the last setting. Repeat this process for all frames. Click on the present button to top right to preview your 3D carousel. That concludes the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give us a like and leave your comments below. Thank you for watching The Savvy Professor.